All right, y'all, we've had all, all kind of crazy weather here in the Northeast. Paul Goodlow from the Weather Channel is in Philadelphia to explain what in the world's going on. Good morning, Roland. Here in Philadelphia, the snow started before midnight and carried on after midnight. Then we changed over to some sleet. Still seeing a little sleet and freezing rain right now. As we walk this way, we can see the Ben Franklin Bridge, the Benny here in Philly, uh, goes from Philly across the Delaware into New Jersey. And the good news is school is closed because of these weather conditions. And look here on the ground, you might think, oh, well, this is all snow, right? About two to three inches at the airport. But no, we have a lot of ice crystals here. This is just, I wouldn't call it packable snow. This is packable ice. I mean, this, this hurts. Another concern is now we're having freezing rain, so we've been very cold here in Philly. All this on this light pole, that's a sheet of ice. So unfortunately, we're seeing all types of weather. We got freezing rain, rain, and now sleet here in Philly, as well as some snow with this winter storm. The concern is things could ice over and you might think, oh, just a little bit of snow on the on the ground, maybe some slush, but there could be ice underneath there. The I-95 corridor, which runs through here in Philly, that's the dividing line. If you're perhaps within 10, 20 miles of I-95, you'll see a mixture. You'll see a lot of slush and sleet throughout much of today and then cold air behind it. If you're far enough north and west of I-95, it's going to be all snow. We're talking maybe one or two feet of snow as you head well outside of the 95 corridor. And now if you're east of 95 towards the coast, you might just see a little bit of snow and some sleep, but a lot of cold rain. But everybody dealing with the wind. Again, this nor'easter is just now starting the wind component. It's going to be a challenging day traveling up and down the eastern seaboard. Again, things should slowly start to return to normal on your Wednesday, but yeah. School here in Philly is closed. School in New York is closed. School in Boston is closed as well because of our latest winter storm. Last couple of days of winter, but hey, officially it is still winter and we are dealing it with it here across the East Coast. Of course, we'll have more coverage all day long in the Weather Channel. Roland, back to you. All right, folks, thanks a bunch. See you tomorrow. Holla! A peaceful protest turned deadly. 37-year-old black man was shot and killed by Baton Rouge police. His hands are in the air and you still get shot by the cops. Oh my God, please don't tell me he's dead. We're not gonna let hate define us. Race is a big part of this. If truly all lives matter, then all lives need to matter equally. What we require is action. What we require is accountability. We understand that black lives do matter. We will keep focus on this issue. News One Now, every weekday morning at seven on TV One.